He's Australia's favourite banana picker turned guitar picker. April Aiken joins me now. How are you going? Awesome, yourself? <laughs> I'm good, thank you. Now, everyone asked me about that story. I mean, it's legitimate. You actually were a banana picker. Yeah, I used to pick bananas and for my job, and now I just pick guitars, but I still eat them for breakfast. It was like a flashbulb going on moment when I really realised that I wanted to be a musician and follow my dream. And I'm much happier for doing that. I really encourage young people and musicians and people that want to do creative things to follow their passion. And so when, when did you leave the farm? Just pack up and go and how old were you? I was 17 when I left home and I ended up hitchhiking down the east coast playing a lot of gigs and playing a lot of music and busking and kind of all started from that for me. And, and how, how long have you been doing it now? Like you've been, you're like an institution in the blues and roots world now. Well, I've been eight years hardcore on the road across every state and territory and uh, also other countries, about 16 other countries we've toured across. And you're like building the 8-Ball name, which is... Well, where did the moniker come from? Where, where did that, the name 8-Ball? Well, there was a gentlemanly disagreement at the pool table. <laughs> gentlemanly. It was, it was a rough gig up in far north Queensland. Yeah. And it was a place with a lot of bikies and prawn trawlers and people yeah. at, at this gig. And, uh, you know, it was a really hard scene. And they had a fight at the pool table and the eight ball landed on the stage. And yeah. my mates started calling me eight ball from then and it stuck. You've been playing uh, Maitland guitars for quite some time. Yeah, I love Maitland guitars. I've got some old ones. And uh, after one of my guitars got smashed in the airport, I stopped touring with old guitars that you can't replace. And mm. Maitland, they, they came to the party and made me the coolest guitar. I'm going to show you this. this oh, I love the it, the Maiden guitar. Mini Maiden 8-ball guitar, and I call it the Mate Ball. <laughs> now, Rebel With A Cool Cause was your third studio album. Was that, uh, was that in particular owed to yourself? Would you class yourself as a Rebel With A Cause? Or <laughs> Well, the idea behind it was, you know, not being a rebel without a cause, but being someone who's proactive with a focus about what you're doing. And you know, a lot of people ask me what my cause is, and I believe and treating other people the way you want to be treated yourself and kind of getting on with the job and following your dream. So that's my purpose and uh, my cause. Uh, and so you followed up Rebel With The Cause uh, with, you know, your belief in music with your fourth studio album, uh, The Tamworth Tapes. <laughs> yeah, The Tamworth Tapes were recorded to tape the old school way in Tamworth and we turned up and there was a few people, you know, when I first got there that, you know, thought, who the hell is this guy? He looks strange. <laughs> and... Uh, we had a lot of fun. Hi, this is 8-Ball Aitken and you're on Landed Music.